Look at this, guys. Got my very own car. 2004 Mazda Xella. And look, I'm the only one in the car. And today I'm at Mobile and Madras Street. And look what they have. A Wash Tech Softcare Evo. It's the last one to be operating in a mobile station. And guess what? I've got my code, so we're going to go through it. All right, so here it is, and I'm going to put the code in. And I can't reach, so... See you guys soon. Right. Three one 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 five eight. Please wait. Program one ready. All right. Sorry about that, guys. It's either my phone's low on storage or I keep bumping the um, stop button. But anyways, um, in we go. Now, I've got to be careful, I'm lined up properly. Oh, sorry about that. Okay. Got my mirrors out, um, but I'm gonna put them in as soon as I have to stop. Okay, and... You should tell me to stop anytime soon. Stop, here we go. Okay, this is very exciting, guys. Now, I think we might be starting off with trifoam. What's it doing? Maybe we're out of trifoam. I don't know what it's doing, guys. But yeah, it's going all the way over to the back. Nah, I don't think it's got any trifoam left in it. It's a bit quirky, I should say. All right, now we're getting a rinse. Yeah, it's not good. We don't have any trifoam left. And after that, we're gonna get another brush pass. Now, fun fact, this is probably the, this is actually the last one to be operating in a mobile station. And this is the fir my first time taking my Mazda Xella for a car wash, that's for sure. And now we're gonna go on to our brushes. Here we go. I should say soft techs. Got a nice plain blue soft techs. Now I'd say this car was just probably like a good 15 to 16 year old, years old. Look at that, we've got the original Softcare logo. And here we come. Now, unfortunately the Istable M12 at Caltex Reckoning has still got compressor issues. So I spoke to the lady in the shop and she didn't know if it was gonna get fixed or not. But I thought, why don't I come out here to the mobile Madras stream from the last wash tech off here, Evo. Ah, look at this. So you can see the edge of the top brush there. Now, you can tell this is definitely an Evo, not an intro, because it's got the side dryers. Now, I should say, unfortunately, the one, the Washtick Softcare Evo at um, Mobile on the corner of Pages Road and Breezes Road has just recently been replaced with a Istable MNEX 22. And so therefore, this means this is the only one left. So I thought, why don't I go film this one before it gets replaced, because you just don't know, it might get replaced within the next year or so, maybe later. You just don't know when these things get replaced. Mind you, it seems to be doing an okay job, but um, so far, I don't know. I'll get out and check afterwards. And yep, here come our side brushes. And here comes our top brush. Top brush switching directions. Yep, you can see. Now, it'll be interesting if this car wash gets to place of an Istable Tracer or an Istable MX22. We just don't know yet. 
So yeah, I haven't been for a Washtec soft kit Evo for ages, guys. So I've been very lucky to be able to film this one while it's still here. Hey, you see, these brushes are starting to show their age. You see how dirty they are. All right, now looks like looks like it's got some soap, but just not trifoam left. Oh, here goes our top brush. Now, yeah, we're definitely going to get another foam up because um, the Evos can do a, a third brush pass, whereas the Intros don't do that. But it gives good soap coverage. Better than before. Hardly no trifoam. And yep, here come the Softex. It's a bit squeaky and creaky when it moves, sadly, but it's not surprising for a, like a car which is like 15 years or, old, or older. And our top brush should come down any sec. There it goes. Now this car wash doesn't actually get a lot of use, which is not surprising for an old car wash. I think it did used to get. But I, wait, here come our dryers. Yep, so um, I'm not the first one to film this car wash. Um, now, what's his username is CK. He's also based in New Zealand. He filmed this car wash like about a year or two ago, I think. But if I find the video, I'll post the link to that. Yep, looks like the dryers are doing a really good job. Sorry about sorry about that, my phone cut out due to the storage being full, so I'm sorry if I had to cut the video short. But yeah. I just had to quickly delete some photos, which I forgot to delete earlier, but otherwise this has been a great wash, I should say. All right, there we go. Now there's nobody behind me, which is not surprising. And there we go, that was a good wash, even though my phone did cut out. Sorry about that, I keep bumping the stop button. Um, my phone did cut out due to the storage being full, but otherwise that was a good wash. And yep, thank you for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe. And that will be it.